What is up everybody? So this is our series on apostrophes. This is one that can get confusing in school as well as on the PSAT, SAT, and ACT. So check it out. The tougher writing questions have more than one error, and that's the case with this one. It says, today's weather is the complete opposite of yesterday's. Florida is unpredictable. All right, so here we've actually got three errors going on. So let's go in the order of the sentence. Today's weather, that is the weather of today. It's possessive, so it needs to be today apostrophe s, today's weather. So that's the first correction we need to make. Now let's keep going. Is the complete opposite of yesterday's Right now, yesterdays without an apostrophe is just a plural word. It's like multiple yesterdays, it doesn't really make sense. And in this case, what we have here is today's weather is a complete opposite of yesterdays and it needs to indicate yesterday's weather, okay? So how do you do that? It needs to be yesterday apostrophe s or yesterday apostrophe s weather, yesterday's weather. Now, the last correction that's necessary is that we've got two sentences here, two independent clauses that could stand on their own. They need to be joined together by either a conjunction, a semicolon, or they could be separated by period. Now, in this case, we can separate them with a semicolon. Why? These are two related thoughts. They're connected to each other. They can stand on their own, but they're connected. Today's weather is the complete opposite of yesterday's. Florida is unpredictable. It's letting you know that we're talking about Florida. So the best use here would be a semicolon. Now, which answer choice gives us all of those corrections? Let's take a look. We know it's definitely not no change. Answer choice B, today's weather, that's correct. Yesterday's weather, that's correct. And we have our semicolon, this is perfect. If you take a look at answer choice C, it says today's apostrophe, which would mean multiple todays, that doesn't make any sense. Answer choice D, has yesterday's apostrophe, which mean multiple yesterdays. So the only one that works is B. Remember, the toughest questions are gonna have more than one error to look for and correct. All right, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope you guys really enjoyed the video and found it helpful. Make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so you know when I'm posting more content. I love you guys. Have a great week. Peace.